Hi, everybody. Along with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro will be seen and heard in just moments. I'm Mike Emmerich, and tonight we get to see the top team in the Western Conference. It's impressive how they've gotten. Well, you see how deep the Western Conference is, Doc, and to be sitting on top of everybody else, that's pretty impressive stuff, but they know they cannot lay off the gas pedal at all here with teams chasing them in the Western Conference. And now we turn to the last lines of defense, the goalies. Marc-Andre Fleury is the goalie of choice tonight and had a Stanley Cup championship in Pittsburgh before his 25th birthday. In back-to-back -back Stanley Cup Finals, he won 30 of 44. Outstanding under pressure. Forsberg's in goal tonight. The coach's decision made with confidence for the Blackhawks. This is not a good goals against average, but numbers can be brought up by a better performance, and maybe that's what's ahead. Game about to start. Jonathan Taves is often the guy to take the first draw because his percentage is at the top or near it. You are here at the right moment with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emrick, and play is just underway. Vegas didn't play well enough to get the win in their last game. Their coach has asked them to get back to their game tonight. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. Uh, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. The Golden Knights are moving the puck in the defensive zone. Still has control up the wing. Hammers it. Score! He got the post with that one. Carlson's ability to be able to shoot the puck that hard and put it where he wants is amazing. Forsberg's not going to be happy with this. He doesn't even move on this shot because he thinks he's in good position, but it hits the inside of the post and goes in. The Golden Knights now have a one-goal lead in the first period. Perhaps they can build on this and carry something sizable to the dressing room. Neutralized face-off win. It's an onside play. Slid to Anisimov. And picked up now by Marion Hosa. Possession held as he skates it up the wing. Good intercept. And he steps across the line. Save! Driving through the neutral zone. Carries it to the corner. A whistle and a rest. Solid clean win. Laid on to Anisimov. Slid back across from one point to the other. Smith cut through the neutral zone. Let's it go. That hit somebody. And at an angle to McNabb. Terrific shot, but a denial. Boy, he really had to battle through to see that screenshot. Thrown in. Puck is thrown to Smith. Moving it to Halla. Good check. No chance on the pass. And we get a penalty. The referee to the table, a player to the box. Chicago's getting a minor. You may have noticed this one. It's two minutes for interference. You got to be in control. You just can't run around and hit everybody, especially when they don't have a puck. And so begins power play number one. Let's see if it's power play goal number one. Chicago penalty to number Big faceoff win. Went to the backhand. Puck covered, whistle blown. 18 seconds. Vegas looks to extend this last 10 game segment where they've dominated their opponents. They've been fast, they've been physical, and they're facing an opponent that has a minimum of confidence as they've really struggled in their last 10. Terrific point blank save. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Vegas lugging the puck in their own end. He gains the zone. 
Shoots. That's a good pass save. Snaps off a wrist shot. Loose puck blocked off by Kane. It's blocked. Tries to clear. And that one cleared by the penalty killers. The Golden Knights power play let them down at a key point. Sometimes when you don't score, you've got to change everything, change your scheme, change your personnel. I don't think they have to change anything, guys. That power play was about perfect. They just couldn't find a way to score. One timer. Oh, that was close. Oh, great save there. Not much room to work, but he got a good shot away. Hatchets one. Save. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a faceoff right near him. A little under nine minutes left to go in the period. Only one goal hanging on the board so far. So it's one nothing. Good work with the stick. And he dumps it in. Right play, right pass up the right wing, and it's on his stick. Drill! A shot that went way off the mark. Boy, that puck was really humming off the stick. Unfortunately, it missed the net badly. Has it picked up. Passing one off now to Roosevelt. Enormous collision. Oh, you gotta love that early hit, Doc. You get to the rink, you wanna set a tone for your team if you can, and an early hit is one way to do it. On through the corner. Ooh, he got in the way of that one. Oh, here's a wrister. Waits with it, and he gets it back. Big shot from the point. Vegas carrying on up the wing. Scorches one. Outstanding save. He left his feet, but not on his own, and not by choice. Oh, he had nowhere to go on that play. The Golden Knights lose one guy off their roster for this one. It's a game misconduct. Chicago's opportunity on the power play is their first of this game. Let's see how they do. Clean win on the draw. This is an early gift to give them a power play. Absolutely. I think you're right, Eddie. Let's see what the team does here. So on this power play, they will resume from their own end of the ice. Vegas with possession in the defensive zone. Scooped up by Hosa. Referee over to the penalty box, and let's find out. The Golden Knights suffer a tripping call. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. Chicago's power play gets a five on three, and it's a long one. Let's see how they perform. The Hawks win the draw. One timer. A lightning light glove save. 17 minutes, 7 seconds. Propelled to Taves. Turned a shot on net. Wide of the net. Forks it to Keith. Slides it to Seabrook. Looking for options. Wonderful save. Tries to clear. And the penalty killers come up big again. It's cleared. The Blackhawks have control of the puck in their own end. Nearing the final minute, shoots one. Puck covered, whistle blown. Pretty routine stop. You can see why everybody learns the butterfly when they're a young kid. Takes away the bottom of the net. The Blackhawks win it, flings it, got it all. That slight hesitation by the shooter allowed the goaltender to make a beautiful glove save. Nap by Patrick Kane. And he steps across the line. Shoots 
next one. And that's one period. Still two more to go. Only one goal scored. Lots of time left to play. Well, fans, don't forget to enter tonight for our team signed poster, which we'll give away before the end of tonight's game. Carlson's goal came early in that period, and nothing happened on the score sheet after. We are at intermission time. Second period about to begin here. Let's take a look back at the first. What impressed you most? The Hawks are down in this game, Doc, and rightfully so. They did not manage the puck at all. If they want to get back in that game, they've got to eliminate those turnovers. Chicago's power play unit will have to be quick. Not many seconds remaining on this advantage. Vegas was get Oh, what a save that was. Gets in. What will he do? Let's it go. Oh, a save. Held there for a face-off coming up next. Fleury's never say die attitude keeps his puck out of the net. What an, a miraculous stop. Chicago's got a face-off win. Let's it go. Scooped up by Carlson. Let's it go. Two sticks together, they cancel. Oh, he'll pay for that. Broad's on the limp after that big hit, Doc. He's working his way slowly to the bench. Guys, bone jarring hit here. He was hurt immediately. Vegas' his trainer just walked straight by me here down to the locker room. There's a player in there already getting evaluated. Face-off win here. Big drive. Oh, deflected away. Knocks it away with the stick. Muscled down to one knee. What a tremendous bit of anticipation there. Play can continue because it didn't come out. I don't know if he's going to make a save much easier than that one. He's in good position. It's a rather routine stop. A little over three minutes have been skated so far. It's a 1-0 game. They win it. Wonderful wrist shot. Terrific glove save, but it's loose. Trying to go to Murphy. Gains the blue line. Free puck off a defender. That roadblock was set up. Looking to carry it. The Golden Knights with possession up the wing. Let's a shot go. He scores! Oh, what a quick release on that snapper. Uh, and so we loved scoring up there, didn't we? Right up underneath the bar, you beat the goalie over the glove hand. He's not so confident anymore. Vegas has increased their lead to two to nothing. At the rate they're firing shots, it might skyrocket. And that's a face-off win. Nicely into the zone. Pitching this went to Murphy. Pass attempt to Hosa. Up the wing and still with it. The goal. Four minutes, Blocked away. Three the Golden Knights in their own end lug that puck along. Taken over again. And possession reestablished by Anisimov. The Blackhawks get their goalie to the bench for the extra man. From the outside, save. Play stops, and still another penalty. Well, 
Well, you know there are a lot of penalties on the ice when the referee takes out his notepad and pencil. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five on three power play, and it begins now. Good job on the draw. Goaltender comes out, and he's got the puck on that big play. The Hawks in their own end, controlling play now. Head up as he carries it up the wing. A good stick there, so no complete pass. Strong play, good reach. Let's it go. At the front of the net. Great glove save, but it's loose. Let's go, a strong shot. Goaltender pass, brought ahead. Heading down low. Chicago's power play did not do it for them. Didn't have time, but he saved it anyway. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. Into the attacking end. A shot, lightning in that glove. Gathered in by Jonathan Taves. Possession still as he moves up the wing. To the point it comes. Snatched up by Carlson. Directing that one to Halla. Shoots one. He hit the crossbar. Pitching it to Taves. Chip to Wingles. Carries it to the corner. Feeds the point. Takes a shot. No room for a pass. Looks for room. This is overwhelming. Point to point pass. Acrobatic stop by Fleury. He scores! That one ricocheted in off one of the bad guys. You could really see this goal coming as a result of the pressure that they had for a long period of time. I think the players on the ice were just out of gas. Fleury's presenting himself pretty largely here. However, there's still room for the puck to beat him. We go down to the benches. It's Ray Ferraro. Word from the home team's locker room is they're going to be short a player for the rest of the night. The injury occurred a while ago. He will not return. Ryan Hartman, time of the goal. Puck is seized by Neal. Gathered up again by Anisimov. Snapping a pass to Sharp. Dogged determination there by Smith. Let's it go. That one caught iron. Slot shot. Big point blank save there. Not often you're all alone in front of the goaltender from this area of the ice. Great save. With a shot. Puck collected. Now it's directed to Hosa. Gets across, looks over his options. Oh, stick save. Vegas controlling play now in their own end. What a terrific opportunity. Hammers one, missed the net. Oh, his shot had the goaltender beat, Doc. He rifled it just wide of the net. On the outside, a shot. That one's right on his stick from the right side. Let's it go. Score! shot did not hit the goaltender because that thing was labeled. And so the goaltender's too quick to rely on his technique. He drops down quickly. That opens up the top of the net and too much room there for a shooter of this quality. The Golden Knights have built a two-goal lead now. Do they keep attacking or do they lay back and just wait for the end of the period? Thank Solid win at center ice. Goal. Now what? He takes that point pass. Cranks one. 17 minutes, 50. Whoa, what a play. The drama heightens in this final minute of the second period. It's dumped in. Vegas with control through center ice. Fires a shot. Blocked. Puck is thrown to Wingles. Fires. Those big pillows on his legs came in handy then. 
40 minutes have been played here and still more to go. A well-deserved rest is at hand. Hey fans, be sure to get your season tickets now at this year's playoff locations and prices. Being the regular season ticket price for rounds one through three, that offer is available now. Don't miss your opportunity. The Golden Knights end the period with a two-goal advantage. We focus on this one, the one that made it two goals, and we'll have more in just a moment. periods played one period ahead what are your thoughts so far Eddie the Blackhawks are one lucky bounce from getting back in this game but what area of concern too many scoring chances they're giving up it is the third period and we are underway wonderful save on a terrific scoring chance the Golden Knights have been really solid defensively their goaltender has not had a very busy night at all the shots have been few and far between but he's been sharp when he's had to be one into another. Crushing hit there, Doc. Everybody in the building took notice of that. Tries to get it on net. Didn't miss by much. He was trying to be a little bit too fine there. That's why he missed the net. Score! And that is number 20. Shots harder than that. What a play. Forsberg's only able to move so quickly. What a shot. <laughs> and they've won the faceoff. Moving it to Holland. Smart recovery by Smith. Passing one off now to Kane. Gains the zone. Two minutes, 20 seconds. Muscled long to Zebra. Didn't get through. Merrill's looking to make a play from his own end towards center. A shot. Sends to the point. Fires, not through. He scores! Second of the game. What a performance. had the feeling, Ray, that there was going to be a goal coming. That the way that they were skating and pressuring and supporting all over the ice, you knew the puck was going to end up in the back of the net. I think he believes he's got the whole net covered, Eddie, but he's left open the low stick side, beaten pretty cleanly. The Hawks control from the neutral zone. Onside. Took that wrist shot. Great glove grab. Trying to go to Carrier. He's got two goals already this game. He's got a piece of that one. Time of the goal. Chicago's in their own end and in control of the puck. On to Hosa. Slid to Carrier. Loose puck, the defense got in the way there. Loose puck, the defense was in the way. Got to kill some time here and get a breather for some. They drop it back in, and the forwards are able to get to the bench. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Chicago's controlling the play at center ice. Dumped in, looking to Carlson. Oh, bad giveaway there. Good shooting place. Vegas hopefully shifting from defense to offense in the defensive zone. Shot. Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. There's one that can be handled by Flurry. 
The Golden Knights have had their way almost from the very beginning of this game. At certain points in the game, you start to lose your energy, but not when the game's like this. You feel like you could play for days as you pump up the scoreboard again. Gets in, looks over his options here. Perfect save. That one comes out of the air and is knifed down to the ice. Oh, broke it up. Stays along the boards. Puck loose now picked up. Looking to headman up the wing. Mashed in. Laid on to Smith. Terrific determination by Carlson. Puck out of play into the player's bench. Clock stopped. Look out. The puck goes into the bench, but some lucky fan's going to get a souvenir as it gets flipped up over the glass. Under seven minutes remaining in the period. You can see momentum in this game. It has shifted, and it is expanding even more. The advantage is four goals. And quickly to Roosevelt. That's a good glove save. Propelled to Belmont. And in flight over the line. The glove like lightning. An excellent glove stop on a relatively easy shot, but he's in perfect position to make any type of save. Beat him on that one. Marvelous save. No time on that one. A missed opportunity from this close in. Turned away off the path. He covers and holds on. Quick work on the faceoff. Puck covered, whistle blown. Chicago's got a defensive zone win. Back to the point. At the point of drive. Terrific point blank save. Not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. That one's tipped. He scores! That's four straight. far up here, Doc. I'm not sure if that puck got deflected. Let's go down the rate and see what he saw at ice level. Not only was the puck deflected, Enzo, it's through traffic as well. You're going to see on the replay that the goaltender's fighting A, the traffic. He's got to get into position for it. Right when he thinks he's got the puck at him, the puck changes directions. He just can't catch up. A little under four minutes still to be skated. Do you think the ice is tilted in this one? Players are tumbling head over heels into the boards. Into the end of attack. Gives it to the point. He throws it there. Pitching this one to Sharp. Oh, here's a chance now on the giveaway. Pass attempt to Hosa. And he gains the zone. Chip to Keith. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. Up the wing, still with possession and with hope. He's got that point pass. Off a of body. So we're into the last minute. All is academic here. Perfect tip by the stick. Let's it go. Puck loose. Good defensive positioning there. 47 on the clock. What a reaction save. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. You got to find a way to put it in the net. Score! He got iron with that shot. The shooter had a couple.
couple of different options here. He can pass or shoot. He decided on the latter and beat the goaltender clean. Man, that's got to be frustrating from the goaltender's perspective. You're in the right spot. You think you have the net covered, but there's just an inch or two that you don't have, and it's off the post and in. They've got the draw. to Wingles. He gets that pass ahead in stride. Gives it over to the point. A hammer shot from the point. Deflected off the blocker. Gets in. What'll he do? Shoots. Save. And he is reefed. Wingles certainly didn't let him off the hook, Doc. He crushed his man as he's trying to give his team a spark as they need to get back to within striking distance. Fires! Robbery there! And that's the end of this one. The game has ended. Chicago's got another loss, and the losing streak continues. So the teams have left the ice and are getting rested for next time. For this time, for Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying good night.